Right, hello everybody. Welcome to the first game of Never Give Up Season 38 uh, CCL. In the booth with me is Skurometo. Hello. Hello, hello. Game number one against Brett's Jim. How do you historically uh, line up against Brett's? I've never lost against them, Gorilla. <laughs> All right, well, nothing could possibly go wrong in this one. <laughs> Playing a guy suspiciously named similar to Lupak. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> could it be could it be a snipe for all ages i don't think it is but here we go and what do we got we got short starting off never give up the team i have a feeling that team is about as uh, valuable uh, as a gym guarantee <laughs> <laughs> well it's because they never give up and the backup team is never surrender which is the dwarves no. but um yeah 39-0 against brett's <laughs> <laughs> Which is all right, isn't it? It's an all right record. How how are you getting thirty nine zero when we're looking at thirty seven four and three? That's with Bert. Oh oh, Bert. against Bert. Oh sorry sorry sorry, as Bert's against Bert. My bad. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Thirty nine <laughs> and zero. I look forward to seeing how this. <laughs> all right there's always i mean obviously you're gonna lose eventually right so like but it's... obviously you've got to lose eventually and hopefully it won't be on your very first game of the season ccl season number 37 not the amount of dicks either of us have sucked that's a clerk's reference okay 38 season 38 <laughs> it is not not that 38 isn't the number of dicks i've sucked <laughs> <laughs> i gotta let it <laughs> oh dear. Hello, Rusey Who. Yeah, I don't understand why anybody on earth would want to drop two. Two peasants. Like, two blockers for peasants. That's just dumb. I mean, with all due respect, that's just fucking stupid. Like, I don't. It's just stupid. That's. It's just stupid. It's like. It's not even lack of Blood Bowl knowledge. It's black, lack of, like. Having a brain. <laughs> I, I don't know what we're talking about here. <laughs> uh, starting with that, down two blockers. Like, it's crazy. It's crazy, man. It's oh, crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a hell of a starting uh, Brett team there. What did he get in trade? An extra reroll? Uh, probably, yeah. Yeah, third reroll. <laughs> no bench or anything. No Apo. <laughs> yeah, I really don't understand it. I you know, <laughs> obviously I was joking there when I was calling it, you know, stupid and everything. But it's like it, I don't like it at all. Like I, yeah, as as a dev, like I just don't see what you're getting from it. Um, it mu yeah, it must just be that uh, that that reroll. But yeah. how much are Brett rerolls to start? Seventy. Yeah. Okay. Super expensive. Yeah. Pound land. Pound land. I'm Greg's. <laughs> and you're Cooper. I just. I know pound land is like a place in the UK, <laughs> but to an American hearing that, I always just think of it's like like going downtown to Pound Town. <laughs> yeah. That makes sense. Well, you gonna actually try and carry it on that ball? I was gonna try and catch it. Go for, yeah. the, go for the 33 percent. Uh, if you catch it, you, you're pretty happy, aren't you? Yeah, Adev, I, I totally agree. Yeah. Well, Jim taking severe advantage of the AV7 right off the bat. Look at that <laughs> stun, absolutely <laughs> dicing this Brett player. Yeah, devastation. <laughs> All this armor seven. It's just getting annihilated. Whew. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Wrecked him. Well, now we get to see what kind of mad lad we're dealing with here. He had a decent... Didn't he have a pretty decent win percent? Nah, 52. 
It's a coin flip guy. Average. That's about as average as you're going to find in CCL. No fuck off. Of course it's in the Oof. Twat. Yep. This is all lining up. The stars are aligning for the two blocker Brett win over the undefeated Bretonian competitor Jim Fantastic. Jim sent Fantastic. Yep. Yeah. Oof, Cows, that's a rough draw. <laughs> I mean it's no two blocker Bretts with shorts, but Whoops! <laughs> Hello, Table oh. Leg. I know, right? Unbelievable. <laughs> hey, Table Leg. How we doing? Unbelievable. He's, he's Kuplins and Angrex. <laughs> <laughs> Grudge match of the century this Sunday. Table Leg Wanger versus Jimmy Fantastic in a last man standing <laughs> match to end the feud once and for all. <laughs> Yeah, it's going to be amazing. 10 p.m. UTC Sunday. Oh, yeah. How oh, fucking nice. Should be done in time for the real Rumble if you like to give this... WWE your money still. This one is the real Rumble. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, probably be more satisfying. Yeah. We'll have about the same amount of people in the crowd. <laughs> yeah. I'm lying. I can't get the 2D on this lad, can I? I can't 2D this lad. It's an absolute tragedy. Well, a 1D is just as good as a 2D with chores, Jim. Uh, it's not, though. <laughs> <laughs> you could 2D him with the ball. Yeah, I can't 2D him after. No, yeah, I could. I could actually. I could have 2 No, I couldn't. No, I couldn't. I couldn't, I couldn't 2D it and be, you know, free afterwards. Right. Unengaged. <laughs> The all important uh, sideline pickup coming up, or end zone pickup, excuse me. <laughs> it's gonna make or break our morning, oh, folks. For fuck's sake. Oh, it's a one! Does re roll it, probably had to. Yeah, I couldn't risk it. Finally gets pass, it in so. hand. Yeah. Can't, against, you just can't risk that level of insecurity <laughs> <laughs> against the team that you should be beating handily. Yeah. I'm going to go here for the inevitable skull. <laughs> no! Unbelievable, dude. <laughs> well, not the worst position to be in, uh, making the Bretts have to fight you a little bit. Yeah. Really would be nice to break the Rama 7, wouldn't it? Yeah, sure would. As soon as one of these uh, armor nines goes down, you're going to be feeling pretty salty. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Not yet, though. No, he gets the extra block, though. Hoo -hoo. Yeah. <clears throat> Here we go. No. Outrageous. Oh, he's fine. Outrageous. Well, I think he's going to dauntless the bull, isn't he? Oh, look, Milo Mindbend just got here and definitely doesn't know what happened to AV7 thus far in the game. <laughs> the bull's going to take one. Leaves it to the dauntless and uh, does not get it. And, uh, yeah, some hits back here now. Yeah, this is pretty outrageous so far. Surviving two mm. dice blocks. Unbelievable. Hello, Muppet. Hello. <laughs> Great, aren't they, peasants? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's about right, Milo. <laughs> we'll see. Still early. It's only been a, only been two turns a hit. 
But he's uh, this guy looks like he's going to give Jim about 80 blocks this game, so there's plenty of opportunity <laughs> for him to finally gas a fucking Oh, peasant. shit. Here comes the foul from one of his two fucking blockers. Please get sent <laughs> off. He does not like blockers, apparently. <laughs> Nothing. Armor holds, too, just barely. Outrageous. Wow. Another stun. Can't complain when the armor does break, but that's still pretty lame. Yep. <laughs> nice little... Uh... Oh, no, you're not going to chain him free. You want to mm. stay stuck in. Yeah, I just wanted to get the assist for the... Uh... Yep. Yep. There we go. <laughs> oh dear this uh this reeks of a one and nine and then the first av7 armor break you take <laughs> is a dead hobgoblin yep basically guaranteed at this point isn't it yeah like you, like you should just definitely reroll this if you fail. <laughs> I've only got one reroll, so I can't reroll it. <laughs> uh, shit! I still would. <laughs> you know this goblin's dead if you die. Okay. Oh, fuck Kill. off, man. <laughs> Honestly. Wow. Well, in fairness, Jim, you didn't put any mighty blow on your chorfs to start this season, so that's true. It's really yeah. on you. That's true. Could have had a minnow hitting armor seven. Yep. And getting Glorious. famous and doing no, nothing. No, I won't get famous <laughs> until yeah. I'm victorious. Oh, we didn't need to go through the whole... I will, uh... <laughs> I will defend. Hey, gang guy. Chorfs, who hurt you? P. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> Everybody, gang guy. <laughs> Thank you very much, Mr. Fantastic, for a, a one and a half beaver pregnancies. Six months. Absolutely glorious. Thank you very much. The seven foot power bomber. <laughs> Not power bottom. Massive showing on uh, on so, claw. Subtle difference. <laughs> power bottom. <laughs> 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 It's true, though, isn't it? It is true that if it's if it was Woody's, then the whole team would be dead. If it was if it was my Woody's, oh, no, he's hit a hot yeah. goblin. No. Oh boy, here it comes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, just the stun. Phew. <laughs> <laughs> it's just as soon as I saw the cutscene, I was like, oh, this is um, <laughs> this is exactly what we predicted. <laughs> Yep. But not dead. Not That's sure what's me. going on on that right hand side over there, though. Yeah. A surf, if I want. Yeah. A surf that's going to require a sure feet GFI or two, I think. Yeah. Right? Yeah. How, how you feel about that? <laughs> Guaranteed fail, I think. Where's that paper, Jim? Does it still say never surf? It does, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm going to try anyway, because I'm a dick. <laughs> 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 oh, fuck off. Oh, oh, hey, again. good. Good. There we go. All right, good. again, no bench, no apo here. Eventually, his armor seven isn't going to hold up. So losing anyone uh, <laughs> to a gym foul... Not the bad. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> Woo! And here we go. Big Patrick taking it. Badly hurt. Glorious. Getting some short and SPP finally. Now, uh, get to do something really stupid with this, sir. <laughs> 
We've already identified that his least valuable players in his eyes are his blockers. <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah, <it doesn't, laughs> <doesn't laughs> he didn't even use wrestling oh, cook. The, the wrestle balls. <laughs> The wrestle balls does not pay off for him. <laughs> glorious, absolutely glorious. Hey, Chad. Wonderful. Well, that's just as good oh, as a surf. Oh my goodness! Incredible. Oh, Incredible. Yeah. yeah, it saved you. <laughs> saved you a couple of failed GFIs. <laughs> it sure did. <laughs> there was no chance that bull was making it over for that surf. <laughs> yeah. Hey, he's failed the Dauntless, it's only a one -er. Yep. Classic. Rerolls it. Gets oh, him. Armor holds again. Oh, he's gonna foul the ball, isn't he? Yeah, he definitely is. <laughs> I mean, if you foul a blocker with, with a wrestler, then you definitely gotta foul a ball with a peasant. <laughs> I think so. Hey, Baz. Yep, hello, Chugs, hello, Bazza. He might foul the Blitzer, yeah, he might. <laughs> <laughs> he might. Well, the good news is if he goes over there to do a real gang foul, you can basically just walk up the center of the pitch. Yep. Or the, or the left-hand side of it. Now, he's yep. going to foul this blocker again. Man, he doesn't like that blocker, does he? Why is he offended him so much? Is it called calcium? <laughs> oh, maybe not. No, he is coming over for the bull. Yeah. The bull foul. This is the new season. CSAB's just started up. Hello, Unseen Walker. Unseen earning the right to be the 27th man in the Royal Rumble. The secret spot with the winningest history in Royal Rumble well history. <laughs> history best shot best shot on paper to win it all yeah oh god <laughs> glorious oh no another gym foul <laughs> folks oh, yes. it's a dicing it is on <laughs> it's not a dicing this is yes, foolish you play see, you love to see it yeah you love to see punishment when punishment is deserved and look at this you can just plow his way through on the left hand central side here. Oh baby. That was a dominant battle royal unseen. Absolutely dominant. <laughs> it was glorious. All right, blitzing, uh, I assume blitzing on this blitzer here. Oh, and yep. there it is, another KO. Woo! I have a feeling your bull's just going to get fouled again, though. Yes, yeah, I don't care. He's a rookie, isn't he? And he's got fixed goal. Yeah. It's, yep. it's negative EV for him to keep fouling him, so... Yeah, now the uh, the armor not holding up so well. Although, again, the two passive removals really help. Yes. <laughs> yep, he's going to probably get a pretty sick foul here on the bull, but then that's the entirety of his defense done. Yep. I mean, his defense was probably done two turns ago. <laughs> <laughs> probably. But it, it, he loses any any vestiges of hope if he, if he commits to another foul. Yeah, a lot of this is pretty self-inflicted, eh, Death? I don't know <laughs> if I'd go so far as that. Oh, well, he, maybe he's uh, thinking, no, he's not going to foul the bull. Mm -hmm. Outrageous. Yeah, I, he seemed quite all right in, in the chat. Oh, bugger, a streamer. Can't opt for a quick concede then. <laughs> I said, lol, you can from this one. <laughs> he clearly doesn't know you very well. 
<laughs> said, Hello. At, this point, at this point, I probably wouldn't point that out, though. <laughs> yeah. And then he said, Good luck, her foot, mate. Which is nice, isn't it? Nice chap. Yeah. Yeah, you know, that does kind of reveal his uh, true hand there, though. It's just foul away. Try and get the the early concedes on day one. <laughs> Oh yeah, I didn't think that it could mean that I'd concede from fouls, which obviously I wouldn't really concede from fouls, but I would oh, yeah. concede. From like on our, on a, like who cares? Game one, you just play through it quick. Yeah, get I'll, done with it. I would just, I would just concede from general frustration. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He'd be, he'd have a better time of taking a full, uh, you know, a full three minutes per turn to get you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. That would be his way to get the concession. Yeah. I can't wait until that timer starts ticking down. We're like, oh, I guess he was watching. <laughs> hey, Scotty. Oh, he's, he's, got, he's got it on. Decided to listen in. You can tell your mate it was a joke, lol. Decided to listen in. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, loop. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, then. <laughs> yeah, there's not gonna be any tactical, tactical <laughs> insight on my end. <laughs> I'm literally just the stable boy trying to keep Jim happy. <laughs> See if we can get two games out of it. Basically a fluffer. <laughs> and it's like when, uh, when, uh, uh, who was it? Uh, when the Red Sox drafted Dice K Matsuzaka. I think it was Dice K. And uh, there's a, a, a Japanese pitcher um, from one of the Japanese baseball leagues and they they were like okay he's a super high profile guy we were able to sign him but we really need to get him a friend like a buddy who speaks Japanese to be in the clubhouse so they signed some like rando middle reliever uh, Koji Uehara uh, just to basically be best friends with him yeah, that's a good <laughs> so idea. he wouldn't feel overwhelmed and then he turned out Koji was an amazing signing he was like one of everyone's favorite pictures awesome it's a good idea though isn't it because that happens a lot with like football and that isn't it when people go to like yeah you don't want you don't want like your highest paid star isolated because of a language barrier yeah that happens a lot in football oh i can imagine yeah yeah i didn't like hanging out the uh the uh the hobble there to get blitzed but what can you do Hello, cheeky Jimmy. Oh, no, he's based the ball. Oh, GG. G fucking G. Well, once again, some, some big hits here. He might... Might really thin out some breaths for the first half. Still, though, a couple KO rolls, and he's got a... He's got a, a chance to make this a boring draw. <laughs> Complete waste of an hour of my life. <laughs> yeah, oh, damn it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Going for the uphill. There's no possible way Lupak could play a game against Jimmy <laughs> and not reveal <laughs> yeah. that he had the worst anonymous alt name of all time. <laughs> <laughs> You couldn't do it without going, welcome to Lou League. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, different person. Nice. Lou's, Lou's been around. He showed up in a few streams, like, a couple months ago. Yeah, yeah, he's still he's still around. I need me the pal here. Yes. Look a dog. I guess I could have... Oh, I couldn't have taken the ball down. It wasn't a fucker. Not gonna try and get a. <laughs> I was just with about to ask. Uh, so. yeah. Yeah. Everything is good. Everything is awesome, as they say in Lego. Yep, Land. nothing could possibly go wrong. 
Yeah, maybe maybe we're in that territory where you think about a bull handoff for the no. score. No. Uh, it's turn no. seven. Yeah, I thought you had an extra turn. <laughs> yeah, no, it just just not not when you've only got two rerolls. If you got three rerolls, then you yeah, can, but... yeah, fair enough. And second half, I would have done obviously if I was one nil up, and it was. Ah, <laughs> yes, Gengar, yeah, glorious. <laughs> this is the reason for the stream title, it's Limpack's Glorious Return. <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be a hell of a match, Gengar. Hell of a match. I would, I would go for the handoff if I was already one nil up, scroll dude. Yeah. So we'll see how those KOs work out for him going into the second half. He might be able to push two mm. or three nil uh, if the <laughs> if he remains down so many players. Yeah. And that would be about as uh, about as perfect a start as you could ask for. He said moments before a random bull death. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ne exactly as Sean says. Never found a nil nil. I remember the day where Rick, yeah. Rick was had you know was made made a new lizard man team, and he's like, "Flip me, guys! I've got to I've got to get these uh, Saurus leveled with uh, block and stuff. I've got to get these Saurus leveled." So and he just he proceeded to like not win about five or six games in a row that he would have just won them all <laughs> you know? yeah. and, and yeah. had loads of S loads of SBPs on, on Saurus's but I uh, just didn't win <laughs> and we surf this guy and then score don't worry I know what turn it is it suffirait d'une clôture pour empêcher que les joueurs se passent équipés par la poule c'est comme ça yeah, no, I G up. I'm not calcium. <laughs> it's funny how much McNaughton hated that I G up ball. <laughs> yeah, one last three die in here. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna have a three D, haven't you? Dudley death drop. You could you could follow it up with another three D too. Exactly. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Again, Loop, if you think I'm coaching him, I assure <laughs> you I'm not. <laughs> and then we you got do a, a bit pretty of sweet a... foul on him, though. You got a pretty sweet <laughs> foul on him. Then we've got a bit of a big Kev Shaw boarding here. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <get a> dirty. <laughs> and there it is, one nothing. Uh, a pretty flawless first drive for Never Give Up. Oh, yeah. To watch that awesome Hobgoblin celebration. Hobgoblin's probably my favorite animations in all of Blood Bowl for the fouling and their and their TDs. Yeah, me too. Yeah, brilliant stuff. It's so good. And this is always a, a worry, isn't it, as as Chofs, because like you don't want to lose a blocker, but obviously you're less likely to lose a blocker than a hobble, and it's like, what do you do? Yeah, yeah I, uh, again, against no Mighty or no Claw or anything, I, I'd, I'd throw Chorus up there, personally. Um, I've been confronted about the decision to do that before in the past. But that's one, that's my feeling on it. Who can say if it's right or wrong? Yeah, it's all, it's always a, it's always a concern. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you get, I mean, I don't know, the way I look at it is, if you get high rolled, yeah. You're gonna get high roll, you know, True. like it's just it is what it is. Oh, you I think that's out. I think I think by the numbers you're creating less of a chance to be removed this way. I mean you definitely are, but Yeah. Yeah, like you you're more likely to get low rolled if you put on the hobbles on the line, oh. but yeah. The higher light, it's risk versus reward, oh. isn't it? Basically, lucky deep kick there against the riot could have given him. I mean, it would have been a hell of a score. But it's still got a chance. He's still got two rerolls. Yeah, yeah, still, still a bit Touch. of a chance, but it's gonna be tough with what, five players, six players. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be tough. <laughs> never give up that game. That team name could backfire. It could, but it's tr it's to remind me to never give up. See, because as Dior said. Uh, in the uh, in the playoffs, I was a monster. Uh, you know, no matter how bad the game was, I was still trying and never giving up. Whereas in CCL, I would have conceded 
of probably two or three of those <laughs> games in the, I, in the I feel like I've been telling you that for months now, that 90% of your Blood Bowl woes have just been expectation and then abandonment. <laughs> and then yeah. abandonment. Oh, it's yeah, not even going to go for a score here. Oh, he is, he is. He's got, he's got this. Oh, he is. Okay, he's running someone down now. Okay. He's good. That's why he blitzed there with his rocket to get yep. another... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blitzer down with catch. Thunder setting up a foul for a second. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me. Well. Never give up, never surrender. And plus, also, I watched uh, I watched the honest trailer for Galaxy Quest the other day, which reminded me of Never Give Up, Never Surrender. Uh, I like that Galaxy movie's Quest. fantastic. Yeah, it's a fantastic film. Not need to go for it. This guy is further away than this guy. So. <laughs> You're already on game two, Calcium? <laughs> Do you have a concession? <laughs> Fair enough. Wow, impressive. Rookie chaos against rookie rats. It's not a. That's not a matchup I like seeing. Yeah, yeah new season just started, and we're thirty-seven minutes ago. It's pro British slang for a guy who's never won SFL calcium. I'm not familiar with that term. Glorious. No, I won't give in until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Jim G. <laughs> and then dodges out up there. So maybe I'll put him in here. Gotta get the knockdown here. Got the reroll. Oh, yeah. He can't reach, no. So just need to All right, one him. scoring threat, and he's got a wall of chorfs in front of him. Oh, that helps <laughs> a lot, too. Yeah. Easy, Scott. <laughs> I mean, also the ball is on the other side of the pitch. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> is easy here. Yeah. Uh, well, Steve loves beer. I think it gets... Uh, it's interesting, right? Because at, at, at 1,000 TV, it's quite dicey due to lack of starting skills and lack of re-rolls, like both inbuilt and team re-rolls. And then at like mid TV, that becomes that gets more reliability in, doesn't there, with some I development and extra re-rolls and apple and stuff. And then at high TV, it gets really dicey as people have really powerful tools that make it more dicey again. So I, that's how I'd say it would go. And for me, <laughs> personally, being better than most people, I don't think that's unfair to say. Um, obviously, I want less random randomicity, whereas if you are not as good, you probably want more randomness to uh, have a better chance. So it would depend, it would depend on your skill level as to whether it got easier or harder, I guess. <laughs> so there you go. No, right, this, is, this was his best play here. This means he is going to have to make the two GFIs to hand off to the, the midline blitzer, though. Yeah. Can he make these dodges? Not going to be easy. It's not easy that those GFIs did help. Yep. Oh, they super helped, yeah. <clears throat> Five plus, three plus. Yeah, you can't get better than that. Ooh. Does have the reroll though. Here comes uh, the reroll on the five plus. Yeah. Oh, fuck oh he makes them, <laughs> makes them all. All right, here we go. Double GFI handoff <laughs> with catch, pass with then catch with catch. Oh, fuck's sake. 
<laughs> oh gosh. Assholes clenched. Here we go. And Selm the Elder. Oh my god. <laughs> this is wrong, isn't it? Two geophones. Yeah, I think you just throw it there, don't you? Yeah, I think that's wrong. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you can only. I mean, you can only smile at something like that. What else can you do? Breaths being breaths, and now the pressure on. Jim's yeah, got a massive it, numbers advantage. Now it actually is an absolute dicing, yeah. Damn. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's something. Well, uh, hey, he did all. To be fair, he did all the right things. He did do all the right things uh, on that yeah. turn. You can't really fault him for getting the dice, you know. No, no, it's not. Obviously, it's not nothing against the opponent ever, is it? In those situations. Yeah. Yeah. It's just bullshit, fucking dice. <laughs> yeah, well, just the children's game, Jim. Just the children's game. Oh, that is such terrible, terrible uh, thing to think and say. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> Isn't it? Like, cause it's not just a children's game when you're there playing it and you're getting dice. No, I know. That, that, uh, the, it, that statement makes, like, it always makes me grind my teeth. I never call him out on it. It's fine. He can hold whatever yes. opinions he wants. But that, of all the things he says when he's angry at Blood Bowl, that's probably the dumbest. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> right, three, six, seven. He's only got seven players. So. Should be able to win two one anyway. <laughs> yeah, uh, Pe Pedro Jack making a very good point. Your team name might be uh, might be helping the opponent here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> told him to never give up. Maybe he would have given up. <laughs> <laughs> Mister Pounce, yeah. <laughs> It's not even that. It's just the, uh, it's just the, uh, the idea that you would like. Obviously, that something like that is said to like, to like discredit the source effectively. To like, you know, this doesn't matter. You know, this is completely pointless. But like, every one of us is putting hundreds of hours of our lives into the game, regardless of expectation of results or how seriously we take it or not. But like, if like you can't just be like, this doesn't matter. It's a children's game. I don't care. Like, okay, then why are you playing? Yeah, like, it's just a nonsense statement to me. Anyway, I mean that doesn't make any sense there, Dev, because you can obviously just change it so that dodges are different and stuff. In fact, it could nerf. You could use D twenty to nerf elves, but. Um, I mean, it's going to be random, isn't it? Right. So no matter how you reduce, like no matter how you reduce it, it's still going to be random. It's just going to make those times where it happens rarer. Like you can't. Well, you can stop that by making zombies not possible, not possible for zombies to pass at all. But like, no matter what you, no matter what you were to do to reduce the randomness, there's still going to be randomness, isn't it? So. I, I always loved the idea that, uh, unfortunately, Fash had for Blood Bowl. It's not what I would want the game to always be, but it was a play mode that I think would be entertaining in which you had a randomly generated pool of dice, just like when you're doing the challenges in Blood Bowl 2 that yeah. displayed on your screen. And then you just had to work within those. So it was still random what you got and what you'd be able to achieve, but you could plan ahead accordingly and use that string of dice rolls to your advantage um effectively uh, yeah it, again it, it it's it's something that would be fun occasionally but it's not like a fix to the game or anything like that you know it would be like a cool way to do it once or twice yeah well someone said about like having yeah. a having a deck of cards and then so like you know once you've used you know it, it, it would it would lead to card counting obviously but you would um you know you would you would know because you would know how many powers were left and all that kind of stuff but it would be interesting yeah it would be interesting yeah yeah finny yeah i mean you'd still have bad luck in it but control like if you got four ones <laughs> one gfi with a ball there was the surf <laughs> 
sorry, sorry. If you got double ones, you could just not do your sure feet. To, your sure feet <laughs> sprint there. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> oh, you know, and that was a one in thirty-six. But if it was a one in four hundred, it's still going to happen sometimes, and it's just going to be more frustrating when it does, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah. So. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, he's still or pretty strong. Like two. he's down not too many, isn't he? So he's yeah. gonna get. Or just use like multiple decks, I guess. But yeah, I don't know. I I don't like. I I've never liked the whole card. Cards for numbers thing. Mm. Yeah, he's in a world of shit. Yeah, yeah. It's a world of shit that can be partially partially cleared <laughs> by about f four three plus rolls. <laughs> oh, he's the oh, first. He's going one. the other way with it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, there you go. I'm not sure about standing up the line on, yeah. Here's the next three plus. Of course. Yeah, his best bet here is basically this, just the quick strike get lucky score here mm -hmm. yeah that's when it used to be in a uh, second dead mm. in second dead you yeah just I like that it up, which seems like why not it just gives an unnatural advantage to elves in my opinion and skate yeah no that's that's very true. It doesn't Nails really that another, dodge. Doesn't really add another layer of anything, does it? Well, speaking of failing dodges, hello, Flicky Flack. How we doing this morning? <laughs> hello, Got the tail end Flicky of Flack. your uh, your last ditch effort there. Commiserations. I assume you ended up losing. I didn't watch the end of the game. Commiserations. I assume you lost. <laughs> that's, that's brutal. Well, he... <laughs> <laughs> Prove me wrong, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey, it was going really poorly for him, guys. <laughs> it, wasn't just, it wasn't like it was calcium in the playoffs against me in CC or in SFL. Oh, God. Like, which was a guaranteed loss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I've got, I've got a blitz. Uh, sorry in, to so. see it. <laughs> I can't. I thought you might have gone. I was wondering. <laughs> hey. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was the guy that already had SVP as well. Mm. Dang. Yeah, it was. Double oh, yeah. G find base the ball. It's exciting, isn't it? Yeah, one more armor seven break with that uh, with Tom Schniz up there. The Friday fuck for it. Oh baby, Get him I'm done that. <laughs> Outrageous. Look. Um, well, I look forward to seeing how Loop pulls this one out of his ass. I know, right? Because <laughs> <laughs> it will be majestic. <laughs> Could just go up there. Just play a lot of games, Thud, and you'll qualify. I'm just gonna go here. Well, Jim's one one cas away from doing that with Tom Schniz flicky. Yeah, he does have four players left. Two of them are stunned, though. <laughs> he's got the ball as well. He's, no, no, he's, he's, got, got, five. Five. he's got five players. <laughs> Still, two of them are stunned. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, the dwarves are made as well, yeah. Got them both ready to go. 
Um, for Battle Brothers and we're I might get rid of them because I might not play Battle Brothers anymore. <laughs> how'd your uh, how'd your uh, your run go the other day? It was you just started a new one. Yeah, yeah it was really. horrendous. Right. Because the game, although I enjoy it, because it's nice to win easily. Eventually, when all you do is win easily, it gets a bit boring, doesn't it? So I took a fight that was interesting, but was hard. Like you know, there was a really good chance of of getting all of my guys killed. And then I didn't get all my guys killed. I got <laughs> I got like five out of seven killed, but I won, right? And I was pretty happy that I won the fight. I was very happy with it. Not many people, I think, who played Battle Bros would have won that fight. And I won it with two people survived. I was pretty happy, but it just didn't make any sense because you don't get good loot and you don't get a bunch of XP. He just doesn't really achieve anything, you know? So, like, it, the game just makes you put tactic, super easy fights constantly. Which is a bit crap. 1D skull, re-rolls, gets the uh, pow. Yep. I don't know about going backwards here. I, I think I would have just, at this point, just been like, you know what? I'm going to advance him up that right side. You can hit me with hobgoblins. If you want a 9, I might actually score. <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe. Because I don't know what else he... I mean, it's a losing It's a losing proposition regardless. Yeah, yeah, that's but the thing. I guess this it? keeps him safe while his stuns recover. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he knows my weakness now. <laughs> He's just gonna cheer yep. fire with everybody. <laughs> no, no. Yep. no, no, I won't be able to make any. <laughs> um. Yeah, that bull. <laughs> that bull is. Uh, you're putting a lot of pressure on that bull there to. <laughs> Hey, Volkaya, how we doing? Yuck. Hello, Volk. Oh, speaking of Volk, uh, I'm hearing breaking news for Friday. Stand firm early booking announcement. We are going to have the final three fired guys. Back in a three-man battle royal over the top battle royal for the number two spot, so they can uh, they can join in with uh, Kiwi Nutsack Attack. That's going to be Volcayo, Marcel, and Crusher. Volcayo, your last ditch chance to make the rumble. <laughs> you already were fired or released. Released. <laughs> But a chance he had it. He had it a few weeks ago. But uh, Kiwi came came through. Instead, Ooh, makes the first. Got him. Well, no. Quote unquote. <laughs> well. <laughs> Curious why you didn't pin him to the sideline there. Because uh, then he could. Move him then he could blitz the uh, hobble and dodge free. Whereas mm. now he can dodge. But he back. still couldn't score. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, if he, he powers the hobble and runs down the field, then I'm fucked on. Whereas now he can't really get away from everybody. Whereas if he powers, if he powers that hobble and runs down the field, he just gets free, basically. Yeah, Volk, if you want to cut a promo, um, you are more than welcome to. Just uh, uh, PM it to me on... Just record yourself, in, or however you want to do it. Just message me on Discord. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're not, because it's stand firm, we're not going to pre record a three man battle royal <laughs> to, <laughs> to, uh, to, to sway it one way or the other. Um, although I, I agree, I think you winning that would be much better storyline wise, so that the only two guys unfired or still fired are Marcel and Crusher. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty good. But uh, I, have, I have an idea regardless of what happens. And you, you won't be off the show either way, <laughs> obviously. Yeah. Yeah, obviously yeah. Oh, Is he gonna lob it again? <laughs> oh, baby. 
This is a pretty tough path. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We've seen it in matches before, though. <laughs> that one. Oh, oh man! Oh, there's the one. Nope. And that time too, GFIs would have been better. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he would have failed one, but still, yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> no, there are no good options. I obviously don't have as many men. It's, uh, it's rough, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, I think in that case, I this is kind of the point in the game where I'm just like, you know what, I've got block. You still have to put me on the ground to get the ball on the ground. I think my odds are better just hanging on to it and praying. Like, you feel better if you have blodge <laughs> when you're doing that, but uh, there's so much tackle. Like, who cares? Yeah. Yep, this is uh, the first game of the new season, uh, Back Zerk. Yep. <laughs> oh, wow, all the armor breaks. I've actually been pretty lucky, haven't I, on the armor breaks? Yeah. Yeah, I think those, I mean, those two fouls were a big difference maker for him. I mean, even though the first half ended up working out for him, having those two extra players right now would be pretty sweet. Fucking you had one in nine. Now. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, dear me. This is the turn. This is the turn of legends, folks. This isn't even that hard. <laughs> Just a few threes. <laughs> uh, a couple fours. Threes and fours. Yeah, I nearly didn't do it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's why I put the hobble there. Yeah, exactly, Joey. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that was okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking stupid. He's got to just go for the score here. He's got to go for the miracle score here. Oh, yeah. Four plus three plus to get into the end zone. Three plus three plus. Three plus maybe some twos in there as well. <laughs> Pretty much an automatic, if you ask me. <laughs> Would never happen to die all. <laughs> oh, oh, my dog's pissed off about this, too. Ooh, doing it the... the yeah. Maybe that's better, actually. That probably yeah. was better than uh, 4 plus, 3 plus. Ish, because the ball down... Yeah, no, the ball down, he's still got a dog, so yeah, that, that is better. Yeah. yeah. Oh, fuck off. All right. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, Jim's on like a slight. I'm on like a slight delay to Jim with my with my with my uh, my client running Blood Bowl. Oh, fuck <laughs> <So>. off. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. So I get a just a second. Well, he will be in a he minute. He will be. Yeah, he will be. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> He's got to make the GFIs. Is he, is just one GFI, or does he? Does that not even change anything? I don't, know. I don't think the GFIs sure change anything. <laughs> My dog is not happy with these results, Jim. No, I don't blame it. <laughs> what? Uh, oh. What? Well? What? What just happened? What? I don't know. What, 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 what are we wanting here? I wasn't looking at the screen. He just didn't try to win. But he could have double, double GFI'd and then gone for the 5 plus. Oh, 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 he wasn't. That wasn't uh, inaccurate. No. Oh my god. Just... He just aimed. Then. Although, I mean, in fairness, not much can get to that ball. Yeah. No, but still. <laughs> yeah. No, I agree. I mean, I agree. I agree. He would have had it there, too. Maybe he knew he needed to stall more. Yeah, I, I, that is not what I would have done, but who can say whether it was right or wrong? Yeah, well, I mean, it might work out for him. Like, you've got to roll some dice here to protect any of this. Yeah, it might work out for him, but... Still, yeah, I don't... Yeah. Still I sitting agree. wrong. 
Ce joueur se rapproche d'un coéquipier. Gets him off the pitch. All right, that that probably seals. <laughs> Yeah, now a surf up here, too. I mean, Jim still needs to score to get a win here. Yeah. Which isn't a guarantee at all, even against no players right now. I know, right? One reroll. <laughs> <laughs> so in that case, maybe he's just looking at it that way, yeah. which I can kind of understand, but... At least we're finally going to get that bull carrier that we've uh, been waiting for all game. <laughs> yeah, I think it's not enough time for the hobo to do it. One, two, three, four, yeah. five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then 16. So, yeah, he can do it. He can do it with, like, loads of GFIs. <laughs> Seven GFIs he can score. <laughs> He's probably better off just blitzing down Famir there. Failing a three plus dodge. Nope. One and nines it. All right. Can Jim pick up a football? <laughs> no. 75% <laughs> chance here. Well, I say he doesn't deserve a tie. He's, he's, uh, you know, it's a bit unfair, right? Because of the, the dice made it so that he had no players left, so it wouldn't have mattered even if he had played perfectly well. Yeah. I mean, you still feel bad. You, you feel bad on your end about getting a draw, especially yeah. when you've removed half the team, but like, uh, yeah, I mean, his he got a riot and scored. That's incredibly lucky as well. Like, his score yeah. was very unlikely. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> So, you know. Oh, fuck. Of course it's a fucking three. Oh, of course it's a double cunting three. Fuck off. Man. Oh. <sighs> yeah, now, now it is definitely the hobo to hobo, huh? Yeah. Hobo to hobo, huh? <laughs> 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 Yeah, the fouls weren't weren't good for it. Lucky here, he cannot make a three plus. Oh, that was not a three plus. That was a four plus. Yeah. So here we go. But Jim has another turn after. This. Oh, now it's a six. Yeah, of course it fucking is. <laughs> that was never in doubt. Ooh, pass is good. Ooh. Catch is good. Oh, baby. And he's still got another turn for safety here, too. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! Oh my god! <laughs> Although, yeah. I had to do it then so that I've got another chance right if I fail. Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, so 3 plus, 2 plus, 2 plus? Yep. Yep, three plus, two plus, two plus. No rerolls. Makes the hard one. The last year is the hard one. Oh, nope, that one's the Well, the ball made it to the end zone, folks. There just wasn't a hobgoblin attached to it. Oh, dear. Well... Again, you chalk that up to the riot. And look at that, though. Tom Schnee is getting the MVP. At least you leveled him. That's not nothing. Dude. You yeah. can keep playing a team like this. You never give up on a team like with a draw. You got a chorf level out of it. Not so bad. <laughs> How many blocks did you end up throwing that? I didn't uh, even see. 36. So, you know, it's pretty lucky. <laughs> oh, not, not that many. Yeah. yeah. Not that many. The way that game started, I thought you were going to have like 40 or 50. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, but then remove people so it didn't get pickups were forty two percent. GFIs were sixty six. And all the blocks didn't really matter in the end, did they? Because of uh, this yeah, he did have with a good point. You didn't bobble box. You didn't bobble box in the end. I couldn't, I didn't, no one could reach. No, oh, the bull, no, the bull, the bull couldn't reach, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty certain the bull couldn't reach. Uh, oh, maybe it could. Maybe the bull could have reached. The, the, the blockers couldn't. If you're, if you're counting on a bull to catch a scattering ball to save your game. That's, yeah. Your game's already over. Well, you still got to do it, though, right? You still got to do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Mighty, <laughs> Mighty Blow. Mighty Blow, oh, God, one of the two. Like, Mighty Blow's good on nine, isn't it? Because you're not that far away. Um, That is the time to take. But then, obviously, first skill is kind of not so good. On the team, is not so good for Mighty Blow. But I guess it's going to be Mighty Blow. Well, there you go. What a disaster. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.